hello hello ladies and gentlemen welcome back to another chelsea road to glory video and today we are presenting you with road to the final uh one of the two cards that i want from this promo is the uh guru Raiten road to the final card she looks pretty good i mean she is only like one uh plus one overall from her normal base card but um i would i would hope or assume that chelsea women's would be able to do very well in the champions league so maybe she gets one or two upgrades hopefully hopefully one or two upgrades um if they make it all the way to the final that would be fantastic uh, but as an 89 i think she's pretty she's pretty good for that upgrade the other road to the final that we did get that does apply to us is the road to the fly final emerson the italian left back that is now at west ham um i think that is a what is a europa league card so i don't know how well west ham will do this season uh in their europa league but if they can get one or two upgrades that'd be great they don't have to do too much uh, be, just because I think Emerson at some point will be able to go into an evolution and that will allow him to, you know, be better than probably any version uh, upgrade that EA could give us. And so for right now, I'm just giving you guys the updates on a lot of the evolutions. We had so many during team of the year that we did have to uh, put together. We were still working on them through Roll to the Final. We're still working on some now. Um, so, you know, everything is a, a work in progress for the time being. We did get 11 wins during this weekend league uh, that I'm showing you, which leaves us for nine wins for the next weekend league to see if we can get that uh, red Evo for one of our cards. Obviously, Sam Kerr was our first red Evo, second red Evo. I was kind of unsure on what to do, which player to do it on. But I think uh, during our 11 wins, I think Guro was kind of like our star second player. You know, having Drogba and Sam Kerr, I kind of was like, as much as I would like to put Drogba in that red card, I think the way the dynamic image works, it doesn't blend really well with the red in the background. It does really well with the white in the background of the icons. So that's why I kind of just want to keep those as is and change some of the other ones into red cards. But I also don't want to turn some red cards to make them look like they were just informs. Uh, so Sam Kerr, obviously we know is 90 rated, but not a lot of people see Sam Kerr. So a 90 rated red kind of looks special and not just like a normal card or an inform card. Um, so Guru might be the the one that gets the red if we can get it you know nine wins should not be that impossible but you never know with the ever-changing gameplay and the nerfs to uh outside foot shot travellas etc um which you know they're they're they were pretty cracked uh when playing against them but i think they weren't as toxic as the uh finesse shots from like 30 yards out that would just go in I think they should have kept the Trivellas as is and not like try to nerf them or whatever because now it's going to be hard to score uh, from some angles which would be much easier with the Trivellas but you know we we as players will figure out some sort of adaptation and just move on from that um, but you know Road to the Final came and went it wasn't really that much of a big promo it was really short you know i'm kind of kind of glad that i was able to give maybe like what eight minutes uh max of content because the only thing that really kept people going during that week was the 83 by 10 which was like repeatable i think three times a day which is a lot but at the same time you know, they were they they didn't feel as good as they were pre before team of the year which I don't know if that's just because fodder prices went super high and now everything is getting kind of hard to pack or the fact that EA have cycled us into 
doing a lot of untradeables and not a lot of coin packs so we just end up with things that are more expensive than they should be and we end up packing the lower rated stuff because that's so common it literally has an infinite supply at some uh in some capacity so the uh you know 83 by 10s were not as uh not as epic as i would have thought they would be during this promo just because the, the promo i don't think it had a lot of difficult cards to pack but for some reason they were just not as common as you would think they were um yeah i'm pretty sure you know besides the evolutions besides this promo there's not there wasn't really much to do you know it was an unwind from team of the year everybody was so tired from just grinding league x league SBCs that you know a slow a slow pace uh promo was uh was probably the best decision you could do you know there's a because the promo after uh, as at the time of recording right is it's still uh still future stars were well into we two which you'll see in the next video but uh road to the finals definitely a good uh, middle promo to just unwind everybody and get them a little bit more relaxed uh, so here we are we have we did pack emerson which is a uh, thankfully one of our good left backs um, that we're able to use hopefully he gets uh he gets to put be put into an evolution for left back i mean he's got very decent stats a lot of the stuff ea has uh been putting for the evolutions kind of kind of use dribbling and pace to determine who goes in where so he's got 87 pace 88 dribbling it might be tough to get him into an evolution soon uh, especially him being a promo card but if we can't get him into one i think that would be great just because of the upgrade potential on top of the evolution so there's that and i think this is the last pack of the video because we're gonna come up now to basically how the how the teams are so far right this is post team of the year so you get to see you get to see the beloved millie bright in the team as she should in her team of the year card design and i think it's as yeah i think it's really good um here i'm just showing you that we are building chelsea women's chelsea men's the evolution squad uh this squad right here is just full of dynamic images which is really fun to look at because it's all just a sea of blue bar the icons this is our silver squad which i know technically palmer wasn't a silver card but you know you get the idea this it's a bunch of silvers that get evolutions and upgrades and stuff like that and this is the main squad that we use for FUT champs only. We don't play rivals with this team. We don't play squad battles with this team. This is strictly just FUT champs. So they might not have a thousand games by the end of the game cycle, but they will be the ones carrying us through FUT champs because these are the best Chelsea players that I can afford right now. Um, but yet yeah, Millie Bright in her team of the year. It's, it's a lot of fun to use this team. Um, but with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, hope I will see you guys hopefully in the next video. Peace.